Louisville takes the tip and starts up the floor. We're going to move it around the perimeter. Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the spot. He did a great job. He anticipated that spin move. They work the perimeter. The center gets the ball. Let's it fly. Great shot. You don't see plays like this every day. Control of the ball. On the elbow, they feed down to the low block. Down in the low post defensively. Great anticipation in the steal. You can see they did a great job studying in film. They anticipated that ball coming to that post. He'll regroup the offense. The center with the ball. Pass down low. There's a drop step. And oh, good defense. I thought defense reacted and beat him to the spot. Very poor job with the drop step. Very slow. Shows patience waiting for the reset. Five second count winding down. With the fake. Defenders right up on him. Set that screen away. Trying to draw some contact. Goes in. Takes care of the ball until the offense resets. Inside. He stole the ball. Great pressure there. Fantastic ball pressure. The pressure got to the ball handler, and he lost it. He keeps the dribble as they reset. The defender right on his hip, and I think he's holding his ground, Dick. Doing a great job. I tell you, doing a phenomenal job not allowing the offensive player to seal the ball. I tell you, he's got every move in the book. What an offensive player. That fadeaway is impossible to block. They're working around the perimeter. Fed the low block. There they come with a double team to stop it. It sticks. From the top of the circle. Way off target. Inside, the center gets the pass. Tries for two. The Cardinals have found a player who cannot seem to miss, Dick. They need to keep feeding him the ball. It's simple. Dick, he's working on that low block on that right hip. I'll tell you one thing, he's trying to deny him the ball initially, but the defense really doesn't do a great job of sealing him off. The Wolfpacks have got to continue to get him the ball. That he's on fire. Trying to pack it inside. On the dribble, gives it up. With a rejection. Too much contact there and knocked him off balance a little. The power forward takes the feed. Good job defensively. They just don't give him any openings. Pressure in the basketball. He looks for the bomb. Nice job of using the screen to get open for that good shot. Gave it up. Hits the ball and now faces his man down in the low block. Oh, very aggressive player once he got up in the face-up position in the post. Dickey's really sticking to his man defensively down there. I tell you, doing a great job fronting him, trying to beat him to the spot, playing in front, making him throw the lob pass over the top. If you get help, you can take that pass away. Jumped in front to take it away. The shooting guard takes the pass. On the dribble, gives it up, and we got a whistle and a foul. Everybody into the act right now, and you can tell by the cheerleaders on the sideline how things are going. Is that what makes college so special? The enthusiasm of the cheerleaders, the mascot, everybody involved. He looks at the hoop. Double team now, Matt Angler. The student body is rocking tonight. They look like they're having a blast. Goes up for two. 
Great play to take that to the basket. And our trifecta for the night. Aaron Andrews on the sideline with Dick Vitale. I'm Brad Nestler. Nice to have you along with us. Gave it up. They strip him in a basketball. Got a little too fancy. Too much mustard there, baby. Trying to get that ball movement, get that good spacing. Looks at the three. Off the rim and no good. He keeps the concentration off the contact for the score. He's open if he wants the shot. He tries the three. He drains it. Both teams looking to get things going here. Time to pick up the defense here now. On the outside. He fakes the shot for the bucket. Unbelievable. Look at that post position. He can't get a piece of that, baby. Had him in the paint, but went elsewhere. Tries for two. Perfectly executed. Trying to stay with him defensively. Down he goes. Oh, what an acting job. There's no doubt in my mind he's flopping, baby. Entry pass in the paint for two. That's a great shot. I don't understand why it's not utilized more often. It's so impossible to block that shot. And a foul, and the coach not happy on the sideline. Everybody into the act right now, and you can tell by the cheerleaders on the sideline how things are going. Isn't that what makes college so special? The enthusiasm of the cheerleaders, the mascot, everybody involved. Look at these fans, they're loving it. My goodness, it's chaotic in here. There's the track. He shoots from the top of the circle. I don't think that's the guy they want shooting that shot. Hey, Brad, their shot selection has been questionable. Too many outside jumpers. They've got to attack inside and then out. He tries the three ball, drains it. Dick, how's he working him defensively? I tell you, he's trying to front right now. You've got three concepts. You can play halfway, you can play behind or in front. They've decided to play in front, which means you got to get help some. He can't miss. And this young man's feeling it, Brad. <laughs> On the dribble, gives it up. Count that as a personal foul. That one puts the personal in personal. Picks up the foul. I tell you, poor play defensively. Look at the facial expression. The post flashes up high if he wants it. Trying to draw the foul. He's money. Guy. That was really a nonchalant pass. Get that sucker out of the game, man. <laughs> I'll tell you, he missed the post guy. The post guy had the great angle, was locking on the box. And this one's going to be a backcourt violation. You gotta make good decisions with the ball, Brad. Dick, how's our focus player doing so far? I know it's a little bit earlier, but what are you seeing? I'll tell you one thing. He has really come out with purpose. He really has. He's making us look good, picking him as a focus player. Guess he's doing all the right things. He goes with a jump hook. NC State are on a bit of a run. Let's see how long they can keep it on, Brad. Turns it over.
Gave it up. The crowd really admires this young man. The fans know exactly how much he has done for this program. That is a dagger in the heart, that shot, Dick. Hey, they lost focus here. They need a timeout to regroup, Brad. Let's see if they can get a good shot this trip. What a great steal. Defensive player was really right on top of that basketball. That's an 8 nothing run. Look at that spacing. And has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that block shot. I just love the history that goes along with their basketball program. The past grades, the championship years, the jerseys, the banners. Really, Dick, that's what this sport's all about. Hey, when you have a history like theirs, recruiting the world's best players is much easier. Picked out of the air. He dials long distance. The Cardinals have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment. They need to keep feeding them the ball. It's simple. Dump it inside. Nice fake. They work it around the perimeter. Had a momentary look from three-point land. Goes up for two. Up and in. Both teams looking to get things going here. They go inside and now back outside. I tell you, inside outside action always works. Good defensive stance there against the spin move. Well, the key is to beat him to the spot. He did a great job. He anticipated that spin move. Isolated on the outside, they work it around the arc, looking for the open jumper. On the dribble, gives it up. Dickey's going to kick it back out there from down on the low block. I tell you, a post player has to be able to read what the defense gives you. Fakes it. There's the pick. For the bucket. Great play to take that to the basket. Stolen away. What a great strip. They are red hot right now. They're feeling it from everybody on the floor, Brad. They're getting it from every spot on the court. Shooter spotting up on a three. This whole team that's on the floor is quick. But so is the defense, and they do a nice job. Ball was loose, but the offense got it back. Gets the ball and now faces his man down in the low block. Oh, very aggressive player once he got up in the face-up position. In the and has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that block shot. Looking for a good shot. Kick out. Got the high pick. Great defensive play. Anticipated well. When you're an anticipator, you got a chance to do well. A lot of guys, they're reactors. If you're a reactor, you're one step behind the action. He goes with a baby hook. I tell you, the jump hook so effective, especially against a big post player. Very difficult to block that shot. He's going to go up strong. Oh, that's a terrific post play. Didn't waste any time attacking the basket. Good fake. Tries for two. Unbelievable. Look at that post position. He can't get a piece of that, baby. Number 34 with the fake. That was a high post screen. Goes to the lane. Looks at a three. 
NC State are on a run right here as of late, Nick. Yeah, they've started to put it together on offense. Can they keep it together, though? That is the question. Steal. They work it around the arc for two. Doesn't go. Run right at the screen again. What did I say? Tries to turn, the defense comes up with a play. What a terrific play to stop that spin move. Oh, and you can see the frustration as he picks up the foul. Oh, that's a bad, bad foul right there, Brad. This is the team's first trip to the free throw line. First one is good. Converts on that free throw line, and that's major. Excellent spacing. That's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards like they have. Yeah, that helps. Goes up for two. And he missed. Gave it up. Great anticipation defensively. For that reason, right there, that's why I love college basketball. Hey, pandemonium is in full effect. And Dick, this is just playing good defense. Really does a great job with his footwork beating to the spot. Let's go courtside. What do you got for us, Aaron? Well, guys, the battle in the paint has played a major factor in this game and is probably some of the reason why they have this lead. If things don't change in a hurry, this game could get ugly, guys. All right, thanks, Aaron. I'll tell you one thing. You better be able to establish post play because that gives you inside, outside action. And ooh, look at the shot block. We got some contact. Nice hops. Perfectly executed. On the outside. On the inside. He used the screen to create the space for the score on the inside. Donaldson is pretty fired up and excited. I love seeing players play with emotion and passion. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that. For the bucket, in and out. Problem with that, when you front, if you don't get some backside help, you're in trouble. Well, you got to get help because you got to see more man. That's essential when you play out there in front of you. And we'll go to the free throw line. Good. Misses the second shot. There they are on the low block. Move inside, and the big guy picks up the foul. Hey, Brad, you can't allow a guy to get the ball in that deep, and he does a great job putting it to the deck and attacking the basket. They're working around the perimeter. Tries one from three point. They let him get into a rhythm. Looking to move it around the perimeter. He takes the hard hack in the air, but he lays the ball in. That's what you take for the team, Brad. Number 22 gets his first minute. Very strategic substitution, Brad. Good decision by the coach. I like it when a team gets to the free throw line. It shows that they're being aggressive. The key is to get to the line early in the game and off it. And 
Griffin. Momentary look from three-point land. He shoots from the baseline. He shows the sweet touch. The student body appears to be pumped up, and they are ready to explode. They want to win just as bad as anyone else in the building. Fake. Dickey's going to kick it back out there from down on the low block. I tell you, a post player has to be able to read what the defense gives you. Defensively doing a great job down there, and he's winning that battle there. I think it's very essential that you establish post position by moving that offensive player out, and that's how he's winning that battle. High post screen. So effective, that screen. He attempts the trifecta. He grabs the board. A little frustration right there. The ball goes out of play. Check out this young man, Brad. He's taunting the opponent. <laughs> Leaning in, trying to draw contact. He missed on the steal. That's going to be the offense's game. Yes, sir. They got the advantage right there once he misses that gamble. That spin move's not going to work against this defense. That's and has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that block shot. And they come up with a steal. He telegraphed that pass. Fast break possibility coming. Looking for a good shot. Shoots it. Got it. Let's see if they go two for one here, Dick. Nice drop step. I tell you, he does a great job with his footwork to create the drop step. Hey, Brad, you want to get to the line early and often. You end up getting your opponents into foul trouble, and it's also an opportunity to get some points. Got them both. Oh, he drained it. Nothing but nylon, NBN. He launches a three, drains the shot. Shot clock is dead. From downtown, sinks the shot. Work it inside, and he tries a drop step. Defensively, nice job. A uh, great job using his footwork defensively to beat him to the spot. At halftime, the Wolfpack lead by 11. Best play of that half. Let's take another look. NC State is showing some deadly accuracy from the field in the first half. Hey, for sure, Brad, this kind of accuracy can easily be carried over to the second half if they continue to be patient with the rock. Patience and poise usually equals points. Second half, Dick, our focus player update, and what's he got to focus on, or what do his teammates have to focus on? I think his teammates got to set him up somehow. They got to run some sets to get him free for some good shots. And Dick, this is just playing good defense. Really does a great job with his footwork beating to the spot.
They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, really doing a great job packing it in. Did a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. Pass down low. There's a drop step. And oh, good defense. I thought defense reacted and beat him to the spot. Very poor job with the drop step. Very slow. Oh, what a strip, Red. He runs the fast break. Marries it home. Foul. You start comparing these backcourts, Dick. What are your impressions so far? You know, well, for me, Brad, good guard play will take you a long way. If you think about teams in the past, they all have good guards who can apply good ball pressure, attack off the dribble, and distribute the ball. I can't emphasize enough how important backcourt play is. Up. The Wolf Pack to find a player who cannot seem to miss it. Brad, he's on fire. Moving it around the perimeter. Throws it up. Jumps in. Got to make that baby. Had that wide open angle. Had a chance to lay it on the glass. An easy deuce. Dick, when I see those types of things, I just get chills. Brad, it's rocking and rolling in here, baby. I tell you, the jump hook so effective, especially against a big post player. Very difficult to block that shot. There he is, strips the ball loose. They get it out into transition. This team right now just lighting it up from everywhere. Hey, they're finding each other in rhythm with their passing, Brad. That makes a huge difference in how shooters shoot. Takes away the pass. He shoots from the top of the key. Makes it. That's an eight zip run. He bombs from outside. That's good. The crowd loves this young man. He's very popular, Brad. He has done some great things on the court, and the people really appreciate him for it. Looking for contact. Great play to take that to the basket. Gives it up. There's a high screen. Looking for the foul. And he'll kick it back outside. Defense playing up. And the ball goes out of bounds. Look at him, Dick. He's trying to pump up the crowd. He and his team have made a series of great plays. And boy, do they have the momentum now. He's saying, get up, people. Get up. Tries for two. I love the sky hook. He cannot block that shot. He gets that ball in deep. Hey, Brad, why don't more guys use it? Watch out, five second call approaching. He lets it go. That was nice. This is what you're supposed to do down low, go up strong. I tell you, that was great post play. Clinic 101 and how to explode to the goal. Working around the perimeter. Gave it up. Entry pass in the paint. Puts it up, looking for contact. 
Let's take a second look. On the dribble, gives it up. The student body has got it going on. They look to be filled with rage and eager for a win. Oh, yes, the student body, always full of comedy and excitement. Leans in, perfectly executed. The Cardinals are behind by 15. Jumps into the defender. Basket falls despite the contact. Runs him first, Dick, and then works behind. Yeah, he's playing from behind him because that tells me right there. And has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that block shot. Scorches the net. Ball comes back out from the post. I tell you, Brad, you got to have a post player that anticipates and knows how to find the open man. Executes the baby hook. I tell you, great shot. I don't understand why it's not utilized more often. It's so impossible to block that shot. He intercepts it. They work the perimeter, gave it up. Very soft defensively, no pressure on a basketball. And with that, there's going to be some open jumpers if they don't pick up defensively. On the outside, looking for a good shot. On the dribble, gives it up. That was a great, great effort right there, trying to play that passing lane. Anticipating really well. On the outside, in the paint, trying to draw the foul. Dick, they're ripping up the nets tonight. They're definitely shooting the ball well tonight. Great execution by these boys. They're working around the perimeter. Entry pass in the paint. Here's a double team. He strips him clean. Nice shot. Leaning in, trying to draw contact. Drops the bucket despite the harm. Up it inside. Takes the pass in the paint. Here's the toss back out from the post. I tell you, coach's dream when your post player can be an exceptional passer. On the inside, jumps in. Great play to take that to the basket. It looks as though the students are all wound up and ready to agitate the opposition. Isn't it great, Brad? That spin move's not going to work against a defense I'll like that. Tell you, they did a great job scouting post play because they were really anticipating the spin. Gave it up. Ball comes back out from the post. I tell you, Brad, you got to have a post player that anticipates and knows how to find the open man. They can't stop this guy, Dick. Want to give him a try, Brad? If only my knees weren't aching. For the bucket, perfectly executed. The Cardinals are behind by 19. Spacing that's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards like they have. Yeah, that helps. Picked off. He made the duck plus an opportunity for one. There's nothing like throwing down a dunk and getting the foul. Speaking from experience, there, Dick. Of course. This is the team's first trip to the free throw line. Makes it. Oh. 
Great pressure, great double team. Really explosive. It's stolen. Turnover. Great job knocking the ball loose, then chasing it down. The Cardinals are down by 16. Tries for two. Sweet looking shot. He is super. He really is. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. Unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, really doing a great job packing it in. Then a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. Works the perimeter. Spacing so important. Get 15 to 17 feet apart. There they come with a double team to stop it. On the dribble, gives it up. Steals a pass. Looking for contact. And he scores despite the hack. Picks off the lazy pass. I sometimes wonder what it would be like to be a Skywalker. Elevating and throwing it down, Mr. Nestler. How much fun would that be? Gave it up. Jumped in front to take it away. Hammers it down. For two, Louisville are on a nice little run at the moment, partner. They have to remember solid defense leads to good offense, which is what we're seeing right now. Double team now, bad angle. Robs him of the ball. Isolated on the outside, they're working around the arc, looking for the open jumper. It's not uncommon to have a few high risers on your team these days. The game has definitely changed in that regard. That's basic. Goes up for two. Great play to take that to the basket. Looking for a good shot. Takes the pass in the paint. High post screen. And the ball goes out of play. Let's check in courtside with Aaron Andrews. Aaron? Guys, he seemed very focused from the beginning. His game face was on, and he understands it's his time to perform. Let's send it back over to you. They work the perimeter. Has a nice look at the basket. Puts it on the floor and up and under. I tell you, good close play because the footwork was excellent. So many guys walk with their pivot foot. He does a great job showing ball, ball fake, and good footwork, keeping his pivot foot down. Get that sucker out of the game, man. Dick, it's really been a while since I've seen a team shoot like this. Hey, every once in a while, you'll get a squad that gets on a tear and simply makes your jaw drop. It's fun to watch, isn't it, Brad? Jumped in front to take it away. Dickey's going to kick it back out there from down on the low block. I tell you, a post player has to be able to read what the defense gives you. Pass down the guy in the post to go the other way. There's a double team waiting there. He takes the shot off the baseline. The Wolf Packs have got to continue to get him the ball. They need to keep feeding him the ball. It's simple. They work it around the perimeter. Tries for two. Perfectly executed. That's a foul. Well, Dick, what's the front court production looking like to you? Well, you know, Brad, the bigs really can influence how your teams play. Rebound, locking shots, opening shots are all very important skills which your big players should possess. Great shot block right there. And some good movement on the offensive side. On the dribble, gives it up. Steals the pass. He 
shoots from long range. Good. Working it around the perimeter. Way out on top. And wow, look at him rotate over. The fake. For two. Sweet looking shot. He is super. He really is. That spin move not successful, Dick. I did a great job on the defense, not allowing him to make that turn. Picks off the lazy pass. Tries to turn, and the defense comes up with a play. What a terrific play. And has it rejected. Defense did a great job with that blocked shot. Looking for a good shot. Lobs it. Looking for the foul. He puts it in with contact and all. Sets the screen for his teammate. From right of the circle, he gets the bucket. Picks off the pass. Gave it up. Foul charge. He hits the shot. They're feeling good. The momentum is on their side, and everything has fallen into place. Their body language, Dick, says it all. Hey, Brad, the kids are fired up and having a lot of fun. He is going to the line. No rebounding that. Well, partner, this one could go right down to the wire. You've got to love these close ones, Brad. Every error is magnified and could be the difference between a win or a loss. He strokes it. It's good. The center handles the blocks the shot. Nice shot. This crowd will go crazy if they get a shot to go down here. Nice move with a face up. I tell you one thing, Brad, I like guys that are versatile in that post. Facing up is a way to take advantage of three basic moves. He pump fakes. Takes away the pass. The Wolf Packs are a stop away from hearing this crowd go senseless. It's a hoop and a foul. He showed good concentration in that possession, Brad. That is a great play. These kids have all the momentum now. Look at them. They're celebrating. Hey, hey, why not? It's a team sport, right? Coaches love it when their team gets to the free throw line. It's an opportunity to put points on the board and potentially get the opponent in foul trouble. He keeps the concentration off the contact for the score. There's the trap. Great play to take that to the basket. Went away from the post and goes the other way. Great pressure, great double team. Really explosive. The Wolfpacks have a hot hand right now that's scoring for them at the moment. That he's on fire. They'd like to get it inside to the low block. 
unable to so far. Nice job of packing it in defensively. Yeah, they're really doing a great job packing it in and a great job of anticipating that lateral pass. I think he's doing a nice job defensively fronting him. Well, it's the key is to really beat him to the spot, get help from the help side, and really do a great job seeing ball and man. From downtown, he got his jumper off by running that defender into the screen. The students are all fired up and ready to do whatever's necessary to help their team win. The student section looks like they're having a great time. With a deep shot from outside. Too strong. He intercepts it. Goes up for two. Perfectly executed. The shooting guard receives the pass. Looking to move it around the perimeter. They'll work it around the arc. The defender right on his hip, and I think he's holding his ground, Dick. Doing a great job. I tell you, doing a phenomenal job not allowing the offensive player to seal him off. The shooting guard handles the pass. Look at that spacing. They're called for a shot clock violation. Very poor ball movement, Brad. The defense is doing a great job of keeping the ball out of scoring positions. Despite the contact. The shooting guard receives the ball. They work the perimeter. Here's a double team. I'll tell you, he missed the post guy. The post guy had the great angle, was locking on the box. Rims out. Time out on the floor. Aaron Andrews, what do you got for us, EA? Brad and Dick with limited time remaining. The coaches will have to figure out their offensive and defensive strategies for the next few possessions. What they will discuss or fail to discuss during this timeout could be the difference, guys. And I think she's right about that, Richie. Play about ready to resume. It's a three-point deficit. And that can change in a matter of seconds, baby. Hold on. He throws up the shot. He hits the tough shot. I'll tell you, he's not going to down with ease, Brad. It'll be interesting to see the level of energy, Dick, when they come out of this timeout. Take some pride on a defensive end. The Wolfpacks will have their fans going silly if they can get a stop here. High post flashes for the opportunity. Fakes it. On the dribble, gives it up. There appears to be a mismatch in the post. They need to get him the ball there. He launches the bomb. Off the rim and no good. We're going to start it all over in overtime. This is when the big boys show up to play. Hey, Brad, look out. At the end of regulation, these teams are tied. And we begin the first overtime. Gave it up. He shoots from right of the circle. Everything they throw up keeps hitting the target. NBN, nothing but nylon. Boy, it's all elbows and shoulders down there, and I think the defense is winning, Dick. I tell you, doing a great job in post defense. A lot of people don't realize that is an area that has to be taught, and this kid has responded in a positive way. Pass down low. There's a drop step. There's a nice block from behind, Dick. Yeah, that's good timing for the defense. On the dribble, gives it up. He takes it away. Gave it up. Tries for two. 
They are heating up this building where they're shooting right now, Dick. The hits just keep coming, baby. Step out on that screener. For the deuce. Sweet looking shot. He is super. He really is. Working around the perimeter. The shooting guard takes the pass in the paint. Drops the bucket despite the harm. Nicky's working on that low block on that right hip. I'll tell you one thing, he's trying to deny him the ball initially, but the defense really doesn't do a great job of sealing him off. He's good for another score. Hands in his face anytime now, boys. Down he goes, and no foul call either way. Wow, no call. I can't believe that one. Cardinals have a mismatch in the post. Can we get him the ball, though? He drains it. <laughs> Dickey's still applying great pressure on the dribbler. The student body looks to be full with rage and willing to cheer on the old home team. The student body looks like they're having some fun out there. Fronts him first, Dick, and then works behind. Yeah, he's playing from behind him because that tells me right there they don't respect him as an offensive player. And they made an error, obviously, but they don't have the great respect. So they're saying, you know what? Let him get the ball and let him try to beat us. He tries the three. Yes! They work it around the perimeter. Unlucky break, and he fouls out. Great hustle. There's a look at the timeout situation. Hey, some people like to call it game management, Brad. Knowing when to use timeouts is an art. Also, team fouls. Defending without fouling is always important. Goes up for two. Great play to take that to the basket. Defense doing a great job pushing the basketball. The dribble gives it up. Coach looks on, focused, a lot of intensity, a lot of emotion. For two, and he scores despite the hack. We gotta roll that one back. Very active defensively, a lot of pressure on the basketball. Wide open for the shot. Pushing that basketball. Defense, 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 defense. Excellent spacing. That's so important to a good offensive set. It's even more important to have talented guards like they have. Yeah, that helps. Take it away. Timeout. Let's check in with Aaron, who's standing by. Well, at this point in the game, it's about being on the same page. Each player should know what the objective is for the upcoming possession. Offensively, you must know who the number one option is, while defensively, the type of defense you're going to play or whether to foul. Time is of the essence, Brad. Aaron's right about that, Dick. Sometimes timeouts can take teams right out of their rhythm, Brad. Let's see what happens here. They cut the lead to two. Hold on to your seat, Mr. Nestler. Top of the circle, they work it around the perimeter. And the fans are going wild. Wow, the energy in here is electrifying. It's a one-point game. One point usually means free throws, Brad. Defense, defense, defense. That is a 
key play at this point in the game, Dick. Right, Brad. A very heads-up play to get the ball back when they desperately need a basket. Well, it's time to start fouling. they got to stop the clock, Dick. Dick, look at the number of points off turnovers. I tell you, getting baskets off turnovers is such a great and easy way to score, Brad. You want to maximize these opportunities as much as you can. And yet another foul as they're just trying to hang on here. At the free throw line. Opportunity gets it. Second one is good. Gave it up. Better fall quick. I've seen you out there with pom-poms, Mr. Vitale, but not looking that good. I tell you what, don't look that good. I can't dance like that, baby. To the charity strike. Makes the foul shot. He hits his second. Give yourself a chance with a score here. Not a wise decision to take that shot there. Hey, a few more of those, he may wind up on a bench. Foul, and that stops the clock again. Well, Mr. Vitale, there's the foul situation so far. Hey, Brad, staying out of foul trouble, then a stretch of any game is vital. You want to keep your opponents off the free throw line and out of bonus situations. Free throw is good. the second. Time out. We'll take one, too. We'll be back in a moment. It'll be interesting to see who responds how out of the timeout, Brad. He throws it up from downtown. He couldn't get it to fall. Our focus player update our final one of the ball game, and he led his team to victory. Well, I'll tell you, nine out of ten times, if the focus player plays well, you're going to get to the winner's circle. NC State narrowly escapes with a win as they take it in overtime. The team has got to feel good about a win like this. That's going to do it for us, folks. Thanks for being along. For Dick Vitale and Aaron Andrews, I'm Brad Nessler.